Ah, excellent. You got my message. Apparently, that little creature isn't completely useless. Banekin can be such children. I hope you've nothing pressing. We could be here a while. I can't be strutting around the city wearing my imperial regalia, can I? Your concern about my fashion sense is touching, but irrelevant. I've called you here for a reason. If we are to determine a course of action, we need more information. By now, it should be clear your prophet emperor brought these catastrophic events upon us. Everything that transpired is his fault. Granted, Minimarco can be very persuasive and charismatic when he wants to be. We all believed him when he said we could change Varen's bloodline with the Amulet of Kings. You saved Varen's life when you rescued him in Cold Harbor. In return, he lied to you about his true identity and his part in causing the Soul Burst. He manipulated you from the very start. Perhaps the better question is, why don't you blame Varen? Varen wants to assemble a new group of companions in the vein of the original five. Claims it fulfills a prophecy in those wretched scrolls of his. Superstitious nonsense, but he is quite correct on one point. We need to find Sai Sahan. In the chaos following the Soul Burst, Sahan stole the Amulet of Kings and fled the Imperial City. We're going to need that relic, and he is the only one who knows its current location. He was captured by Minimarco's agents and taken to an undisclosed location. We need to find out where he's being held. Minimarco keeps his most secret documents at Norbolk, a hidden lair of Daedric cultists in the Stormhaven countryside. We must travel there and search for clues. Travel to Stormhaven's eastern reaches and look for the Norvalk ruins. I will be waiting for you inside. If I can endure Titanborn's inane prattle, I can survive your assuredly erudite elucidations. Proceed. Ah, there's the rub. With my untimely defection. My family will likely be divested of its holdings. The name Tharn is probably being stricken from every document in the Imperial Archives as we speak. I detest being on the wrong side of history. Don't sound so smug about it. This is a setback, nothing more. By allying with you, I will liberate the Empire from Menemarko's grip. The Empire is all that matters to me. I will do what I must to ensure its survival. Clivia. She is comfortably lodged in Menemarko's pocket, along with my nephew, Javard. I doubt they've given my disappearance a second thought. Ah, fair Clivia. My charming girl grew to be a ruthlessly ambitious woman. I taught her well. Well, if you must pry, I am Chancellor to the Elder Council and Overlord of Nibine. But of all my titles, the greatest is my family name, Tharn. We are the greatest of the noble houses, with seats at the Imperial Court for countless centuries. Politicians? A grossly inadequate word to describe our duties and our legacy. The Tharns have a storied history of advising kings and emperors that can be traced back to the First Era. We understand the ebb and flow of power. I'm going to live forever, or at least die trying. 